Hi viewers, how are you viewers? I hope you will be fine viewers. Viewers, today I am going to share a very important video with you. The video that I am going to share with you is related about a very important topic of physics. We are going to know about a very important topic of physics in this video. So viewers, the topic that, I'm go uh, that we are going to uh, know about uh, is, uh, is a type of friction. So viewers, finally I tell you that the topic of my video is the sliding friction. Yes viewers, we are going to know about sliding friction in this video. So let's find it on Google. We are finding it on Google. We are finding it on Google. Uh, because Google gave us proper information about anything. We are writing it here. Sliding friction in physics. So viewers, we have found it here and we got the results. So first of all, we are taking its overview. We can define sliding friction as the resistance created by any two objects when sliding against each other. This friction is also known as kinetic friction and is defined as the force that is needed to keep a surface sliding along another surface. What is sliding friction and its example? The sliding friction is friction which comes into play when surface of one object moves relative to surface of another object. It is also called as kinetic friction. It is that force that keeps uh, a surface sliding with another surface. Uh, for example, if book is kept on floor, the, uh, the book moves with respect to the floor. What is the formula for sliding? The point of sliding occurs when the upper limit of the frictional force is reached, i.e. f is equal to micro r is equal to mg sin theta, mg sin theta uh, greater than micro r and f is equal to micro r. Some typical values of micro are given in table 1. Notice micro can be greater than 1. What is sliding caused by? Let's see what is the cause behind the uh, occurring of sliding friction. Sliding friction is a result of minute microscopic irregularities on the surface of the objects in motion. Rolling friction is caused by the deformation and recovery of surfaces in contact. Factors influencing in sliding friction are the texture of surfaces, weight of the bodies in motion, etc. What are three examples of sliding? So, viewers, let's take its example. Here are some examples. So, let's read it. The, uh, them sliding uh, pushing and uh, pushing an object across a surface rubbing one's hand together hands together the friction force generates heat a car sliding on ice a car skating as it turns a corner opening a window almost any motion where there is contact between an object and a surface falling down a bowling lane, bowling lane. Next is what is called sliding friction. We can understand sliding friction as the resistance force we created between any two bodies when sliding against each other. This friction is also called kinetic friction. And it is defined as a force that is required to keep a surface sliding along another surface. Viewers, I hope my video had been very beneficial and informative for you. 
लाइक माई वीडियो एंड सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल ऑल्सो एंड थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो